initially, uh, our concern was to deploy an automation system. Siemens came to us with a process that said that we can do it at a speed that will restore power to customers almost to a point that they won't know that they even saw an outage. The Siemens distribution feed automation system will find a fault, isolate the fault and reconfigure a feeder in about 200 to 300 milliseconds. A technology simply stated is differential protection. So we could use JDIF to find a fault and isolate a fault on a feeder network. It's very selective, it is very fast and it's very simple. We do have some severe weather coupled with some tornadoes. So we are impacted to a great deal by weather conditions. The segment that supplied the hospital was prone to uh, traffic accidents, mainly because the feeder ran adjacent to a main highway thoroughfare. In fact, uh, we refer to it as a Broken Pole Alley. In the past, it's been my experience that they had, they would have more extended deck brownouts or a long time without electricity. It could have been three or four hours. When we go into those sort of time frames, we might have to shut down an operating room. We can't do an emergency case. We have to start shipping patients. Patients have to be manually ventilated. Maybe we can't even run our, our equipment. We have most of it on generator, but if it goes for anything extended, and we have had some extended issues here with hurricanes and things of that nature, the workload on the individuals and the ability for us to care for our patients is compromised. We realized that if we could restore power in less than 400 milliseconds, they would not even have to start the generator. The generators only have the capacity to do your critical equipment, but you have those blips in the technology. Those blips sometimes cause us problems. We have to reset every computer, you have to reset equipment, and it can actually cause uh, some pretty severe damage to our equipment. Other systems available out in the marketplace that relies on centralized approaches can take minutes, two, three, four minutes, or up to hours to reconfigure. For them, moving from hours to milliseconds is a big difference, and especially for the hospital or critical loads and commercial loads that they have on this feeder system. It's odd for probably a rural community to be able to have this kind of service. This allows us to stay up essentially all the time. It doesn't get any better than that, not in healthcare. The grid is real-time, so if we want to go to a smart grid, we need real-time systems, and that is exactly what the SDFA is. It's a real-time system. It works in a blink of an eye.